what's up guys welcome back you are watching for tech so we got this new amazing device for our channel that is oneplus 11r currently i am using this device with oxon os 14 v806 but as oneplus started the new series of updates for oneplus devices we got this new v807 u130 p00 update with pretty useful small change log still update size is pretty big it's of 640 mb so today in this video we are going to check out all the new changes of this update along with its performance in comparison with the old build v806 of this device if you are using the oneplus 11r then you must subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for the future notification of our videos because in the upcoming days we are going to release the videos on almost all the different topics for oneplus 11r now without further ado let's get started Our installation of new update had been finished. Let's first check out the changes we got in the about device section. Updater section now showing our device is updated to the newest firmware version V807. And we can also show you the change log here about this new update if you wish. Android version is same, it's Android 14 but now we got the September security patches for this update. OnePlus 11R will get the new Oxon S15 update soon. Once you get it, we will thoroughly review that also. Version section has updated the firmware version to the V807 EX01 U130P00. Now we will thoroughly check out the new changes provided by the OnePlus in this new update. First big change is for the clone app feature. If you go under the app cloner option here, if you create the clone apps for any application, suppose here I created the WhatsApp clone app. In this setting, now who gets the default app to be open option while searching the app via OnePlus Scout search feature. If you set the default app to open as I always ask. After this, if you search the application via OnePlus Scout and tries to open the application, it will ask us which application we want to open like default original one or the clone one. Similarly, if you set this setting to the original or the app clone, we will not get any prompt regarding which application we want to open. It will redirect to the stock WhatsApp or the clone WhatsApp application. Another feature OnePlus added for the app cloner is the fuzzy search. We can directly search the apps by using the fuzzy search that supports the cloning. Next thing OnePlus added is the default alarm sound for the OnePlus clock application. We all know that we can set a different alarm sound for each different alarm. But if you want to set a default alarm sound for all the alarms, for that go to the alarms and choose the default as the setting. Now go to the default alarm option, there set the default alarm sound and it will be get applied for the all the alarms. That's it, we don't need to change all the alarm sound manually, it will be set as a default alarm sound now. Next is just the improvement for the Bluetooth compatibility for the new Bluetooth devices. Next is just the improvement for the Bluetooth compatibility for all the new Bluetooth devices. It's now more compatible with the car Bluetooth. So these are the small changes added by the OnePlus along with the system stability which improves the overall performance along with the battery of the device. So we did the Geekbench test for this new update. For the CPU we got the score of 843 and 3313 for the single and multi-core respectively which were greater than the older build version 806. Old build has a very low score of 810 and 3054. Let's check out the GPU performance for the OpenGL. New build has the score of 5990 while Hulkan has the score of 7757. While old build has the score of 6006 and 7728 for the OpenGL and Hulkan graphics respectively. Here I didn't found any major score difference for the both the old and the new build. I am first time using this device after OnePlus 9RT, still its fluidity and the haptic feedbacks are amazing with this new update which definitely felt me I am using different device than the OnePlus 9RT even though the aesthetics of the OnePlus 11R and 9RT are almost same. In the upcoming videos we are thoroughly going to do the comparison between the OnePlus 11R with the OnePlus 9RT. So stay tuned, please do like and share this video, subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for the notifications of amazing content for OnePlus devices. Thanks for watching, see you next time, take care, bye bye.